Good morning, y'all. Look, I'm not really sure what this video quality is gonna be like today because I am recording with the camera this way. Now, if you're a content creator, you know that's a no, no, we don't do that. You record with the camera the other way, but today I'm doing it like selfie mode because I really wanna see what I'm looking like as I'm getting ready and talking to y'all. Yeah. Hey, baby. I'm getting ready to take the kids too. Now you can see. I'm getting ready to take the kids to the library. So I just splashed some water on my face. I never really wash my face in the morning. I'll say that. Okay, I'll take a towel and wash, like wipe it off with a hot towel. But I never really like wash with all the soap and all that that's at night in the morning which is like literally five hours after i go to bed i just splash water wakes me up i've talked about this so i've done that already but i am gonna put some moisturizer on this face because uh yeah and i got this number seven love it go get it it's kind of pricey no, i ain't paid for mine gifted but hey you know it's cool i love it and it makes your face feel like silk let me show you again real quick and you could screenshot it but that's it. I absolutely love it. Swear by it. All that. Don't mind my jittery hands. <laughs> I just had a triple shot espresso. So Blake makes me a double shot in the morning and you just push the button in the, you know, if you have an espresso maker, you know, you push the button and it goes down like two. And then after it, I always push like one more time. But anyways, that's neither here nor there. Um, somebody was up in the middle of the night, probably around like, started like three. She watched all the Nemo, watched some a good dinosaur, finally fell asleep in the middle of a good dinosaur. Slept for like another hour. Oh, you don't need that one, thank you. Slept for like another hour. And now she's up again with me. So where we're about to go, I'm sure she gonna cut up. But the kids don't know where we're going, so anyways. I'm going with some, um, I'm going with some tinted moisturizer. Mercy, please don't throw the car in the vent. Please, she loves to come in, take whatever she has, lift up the vent, because I told y'all, I need to just put some super glue, I know. You're gonna say, you've been talking to us about this vent. I know, I know. All I really gotta do is put some adhesive down there and it'll be fine, I know. But, it's just not one of those things you think about until you're in the moment, like right now. I'm not about to stop and do it now, because I'm trying to get out of this house. Anyways, I'm gonna tell you real quick where I'm taking these kids. I'm taking them to oh, she plays with the most random. This is why my bathroom counter is always messy. Get your car, go beep beep. Bye bye. Vroom vroom. You wanna say hi? Say hey, Mr. O. Tick tick. Tick tick tick. All right, go. Bye. Shout out to the Sanders. We love y'all. Anyways, um, go follow Melanie. Just be Melanie. Go follow her. <sighs> Where was I going? Y'all know the ADHD. Oh, so I'm taking them to this place called, this is out, called uh, the, Imagine On, the Imagine On Library. It's in Charlotte. It's one of the biggest places, one of the biggest libraries. I think it's the biggest, actually, in Charlotte or in North Carolina. Oh, it's hot. I can't put this on right now. The espresso is getting me. I'll put it on when I go outside. She's snorting like a pig. Yes? I got, I got a question. I got an answer. Are we, when we're done eating, are we supposed to, what are we supposed to do? When Clean we're your eating? mess. Oh. And then you can leave the other bagels and the other bananas on the table for the other girls. Um, Clean your mess and then tell Dylan she needs to get up. Cause you guys gotta make that bed. Since you, didn't you guys all sleep in there? Yes. Yeah. You made the bed? No. Oh. Yo, you clean the mess? Man, you're such an intentional little boy, an amazing little boy. And I'm so proud of you every single day. Um, anyways, I'm taking them to the Imagine On. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm trying to focus. I see I'm not good at this. You know how people be doing the videos where they're like, and one day, and all of a sudden they got blush on the next day, and then I and then they got eyeliner. I can't do that. I talk and stop too much. So, or maybe that's why they do it because they talk and stop like me. This library though, it's it's awesome. 
it's like a children's museum combined with a library and it's free totally free and they have homeschool days so today's a homeschool day we're gonna go listen to some story time i think they have like a ice cream making or something going on today um I, once a month they have like a lego tournament for boys i mean like that is it's a dope library when we first moved oh she has a stick hold on Hi, mommy. get that stick from her ah. thank you yes baby you need some help with what? Why do you have my shea butter? I'm putting it back. Did you put any on your face before you hit that land? Please put something on your face. Not too much. I don't want you to be greased up like chicken. I must postpone this conversation because my son's in here. We'll talk about this again. Did you have a nice sleep? Yeah. Good. What'd you dream about? Do you have any good dreams? No? Do you have bad dreams? You don't want to know. I don't want to know. Oh, I actually do want to know. Do you feel comfortable telling me? No? Okay, well, that's that's fair. Well, whatever it is, I pray right now that God gets it out your head and that it doesn't bother you all day, okay? It actually bothers me every day when I'm not crying. I'm so sorry. Well, I pray that that, that spirit of anxiety and anxiousness off of you right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Did you put some... um? Should I put it on? I'm just gonna give you this much. Put it open your hand. Rub, 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 rub together because this one is a lot thicker. And now rub it all over. And go put deodorant on, which is downstairs under the sink. Mm, 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 mm. What you singing? No, I know I'm doing this. Oh, rubbing it. <laughs> You're so cute, son. Um, we're gonna try to start doing more things. Like we do a lot of fun stuff here at the house. Y'all see my house? It's like a whole daycare inside. <laughs> the kids have a whole classroom, basically. But I want to get out of the house more because something happened and they kind of rubbed me the wrong way. Not, you know, I, not in a gaslighting way because I will never take what they say and turn it and make it my issue. It's not my issue. If they tell me something and they voice how they feel about something, I would never say to them, yeah, well, you made me or the reason did it, the reason I did that. No, your feelings are valid. If you feel like that's what happened, hey, who am I to tell you no? So I feel like, you know, they want to go to school next year. And I feel like it's because of me, you know? Like, they always catch me in between babies and all that stuff. So, you know, the hormones, y'all know how I get. That's not an excuse. Well, now that I'm really, really in my healing journey. Now that I'm really in my healing journey. Um, I'm really trying to work against that. The yelling, the screaming, the keeping my temp temper under control and all kinds of stuff like that. You know, I don't spank them at all. But, um, but oh, I, I can be a little loud. Well, I used to be a little loud. Well, I think that that really with them to the point where I'm not gonna lie to you. I've tried everything. I've, I've tried to scare the hell out of them by school. Oh, you're not going. You don't want to go to school because not... they still want to go. So that's my fault, 100. percent I will take that blame. I will never not take that blame. I will never be one of those parents that say. That's not true. That didn't happen to you. You're embellishing. You're like, hi, baby. Good morning. You had nice naps? I'm giving a tug. Well, are you going to stay here and miss out on the fun? No. Oh, my goodness. Go get your clothes on. And then we can uh, go. And your breakfast is already made downstairs. Okay? Your leggies hurt? Mm -hmm. Yes? I'm going to my toes. Huh? Yes, I'll get you close. Let's go. Uh oh, leave out. Ah. This one. Ooh, light on in here. Let's clean this camera. It's dirty. All right, let's get your clothes, girl. You want jeans? These jeans? I know. Jeans? One, watch this. There you go. And pinch. Can you do it? Squeeze, squeeze. I know you can. Squeeze it. There you go. You're left-handed, so use your strong left hand. There you go. And those toes curled up. We got to get some baclofen. Get you some medicine in a second. Okay. Um, I like this one. What about this one? I love this one. So pretty. Makeup doesn't make you pretty. It enhances your pretty. Your pretty. Go. That's all you need. 
<laughs> You're welcome. Can you say mama's name? Yeah. No, dad, dad. You excited? I'm holding on. You know where we're going? Yes, no. I'm holding on to this. Eda, where are we going? Santa Pot. I don't know. We'll see. I won't get any germs on. So you want any germs? Yeah, that's why oh. I was touching you with All right, let's see. Thank, Thank you. you. All right, let's go. Oh my goodness. Y'all want to go jump on those? Jump! Is that where we're going? No, yes. Jump! <laughs> I have an idea. Hang on. A, B. Where's he? Oh, wait. Well, what's D? What's D? Mommy, look. Look what you're not stepping on. Q. Do you see it? Oh. X. X. Z. What are you stepping on? What? U. Just had fun from the kids' library, and now we're going to the car to go eat. Well, for Charlotte, well for Charlotte, it is pretty likely for every day to eat pizza. For city, we're going. We are going up the elevator. Yeah! Yeah, Mercy's sleeping, okay? So go back in there. Oh, Carter's sleeping? Okay. Hey guys, we just got back from the Children's Museum. We had a really good time. I met uh, someone there. She had. She has four boys and one girl, and you know, we have four girls and one boy, so we met up. Her name is Sarah, very, very sweet lady, or, you know, I'm about to say maid, I say lady, but you know, how that goes. Um, but yeah, she was really, real cool, and we just hung out and let the kids play, and it was a good time. So, I'm um, always, it's always nice to let the, are you okay? It's always nice to let the kids play, and then, um, get some mommy time. So, she and I exchange numbers, and we're gonna, like, you know, go out and hang out and stuff like that, get some drinks, and or just let the kids play or whatever and she doesn't live too far from here but we did that and I, like i told you guys i want to start doing more field trips and things like that with these children because <sighs> i'm losing time on the times when they're going to want to go to the imagination station or the imagine play area you know what i'm saying like i'm losing that i know they seem really young but with all this youtube and ipads and all that crap they do like they lose it pretty fast and no i'm not going to not let them have it because they are going to go to school and they are going to live in the world i know a lot of people don't want to get their kids phones and stuff like that and i get it that's completely your choice i just don't want my kids completely not knowing how to use it because they are using these things in the schools they're using computers they're using laptops they're using you know whatever you need to know how to operate a phone at least to call me a 911 so yeah they do get it i don't care and they know it they're proficient in that this, that's the way the world goes. That's the way the world is. You need to know how to do it. That's just how I feel. But that's neither here nor there. We're back. Kids ate some lunch. I picked up Wendy's. They smashed that. That's gone. Um, Mercy is sleeping like a baby. And I have some lunch from what I made last night. Let me show you real quick what I had. So I made Blake and I some dinner last night or lunch or whatever. Lunch for today. I was meal prep. And I just got some mozzarella chicken, sweet potatoes, and veggies. But I think I'm going to wait because the kids ate all the Wendy's. <laughs> 
So I'm just gonna wait until Mercy wakes up and then I'll share it with her. So until then, I'll just have like a banana or something to tie me over because I haven't eaten anything. I'm kind of nauseous. But that's it. Oh, I have one basket, just one, right there. One of laundry to do. Um, I've been really keeping up with it. It's been great. So yeah, that's what we're doing now. Um, just really trying to stay on that. It was the best. It was so time consuming and everything to do all that stuff and take all the stuff out of their closet and sort it into donate and sell and all that stuff. But the aftermath of it has been amazing. We literally have just enough clothes to just make sense. It makes sense, you know, like to just limit. My kids were having clothes just hanging in their closet, hanging in their closet, things that we missed a lot, things that would still have the tags on them and stuff. And you know, you laugh and joke about that when you're young. Oh, they still have clothes with tags. When you get five kids, it's not a joke anymore. No, for real. Why are there clothes in this closet with tags on it? And why do y'all keep wearing the same things over and over? So what I did was, if you want to wear the same things over and over, let's pick your five favorite shirts. Let's pick your five favorite pants. And that's what I did. I went shopping and got them five and five. And that's what we do. So we just, every day, and every single day we do laundry. In a family like this, you have to do laundry every day. You know, I know it seems like obsessive, but you literally have to. And when I am behind on laundry, as y'all seen, it just piles up and it just gets worse and worse. So you literally have to do it every single day. And that's what we do. But I'm rambling. Let's go get this laundry done and then we can be done and we're going to sit down for probably three seconds because I'm sure Mercy will wake up right after that. And then we'll eat lunch, me and her, and finish up school with the kids. Now, since today was a field trip day, they will not have a lot of schoolwork. This is what you have to understand. Uh, we do not do a lot of field trips. We're about to start doing more, like I said. We don't do a lot of them. But since it was a field trip, they will not have a lot of schoolwork today. They will have um, just a little bit. So what's up, Carter? Tickling um, Eden with with the vacuum. Mm -hmm. um, I tickled the the kid toot. vacuum. I I tickled the toot out of her. Or she tooted. Mm -hmm. She's so cute. <laughs> Where's the bottom part of your vacuum? No no no, Mercy. Mercy's gonna sleep. Go the other way. Go 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 go. Look at Carter's little outfit. You want to show them your outfit you made? That's a sweatshirt, and she made it a skirt. Hold on, Eden. Be patient. Just use your words. Just use your words, baby. You don't have to do that because she thinks that you're playing. So if you don't want her to do something, just use your words. Ooh. Are you going to show your dress or no? Yes. So this is a shirt. I folded it down, and uh, I tied a bow on the front, then twirled it on the back. It's so adorable. And I rolled it down. To make a skirt. It's yeah. so cute. You're a fashionista, you know that? <laughs> you have my whole face, kid. All right, girls. Can y'all go in the other room? Baby's sleeping. Oh, don't lick it. What's out there? What's out there? <laughs> Why? Oh, well, go do your exercises. Yeah, so she's doing her exercises because today is, like I was saying, they don't really do uh, school work and book work on the days that they had field trips. Just like if your kids go on a field trip, they're going to be going all day. They're not going to do much, but they do have PE on field trip days. So that's what she's doing now, finishing up her PE. And that's it. Look at this one. She's moved a chair, made herself comfy. Ma'am, what part of that is safe? Don't put your toes there, please. Can you please not put your toes there? What happened to your face? Let me see your eye. My boo-boo. Your boo-boo. Oh, baby. You're playing? <laughs> All right, yeah, so here we go. That's from my top. Here's my lunch. I cannot wait. Sweet potato. I don't have anything on it. Just plain sweet potato. Steamed carrots, broccolini, and... Mmm. Mozzarella chicken. So, so good. You got to try to have a recipe. Let me know if you want it. So have y'all ever seen like an owl up close? Look at, we have one that comes in our tree. You see him? I wish he would look so you can see, but that's an owl. It's like right, where's my little finger? <laughs> it's like, I get, I got this on zoom zoom, it's right there. So cool. 